It's your favorite trucker, cute Deezy, the double the easy. Another episode about sim eyes. How about it out there, drivers? Well, I was came out yesterday, had a good week planned. Technically still do, but I'm not sure how it's gonna play out because my trailer wheel seal leaked and probably ruin the shoes that I just put on to you guys remember I just did all four wheels on the trailer um, less than a month ago crazy thing is the same wheel seal that's leaking I had just had done about six months ago and I took the trailer back to the people the first time because I told them that I felt like that hub was running hotter than normal and I do carry a temperature gun in my truck, so I checked the temp on the hub compared to the other hubs, and there was a big difference. One of the issues was they used oil in the new hub seal with the new hub on one wheel. The rest of my wheels are all grease. So theoretically, grease is going to run cooler than the oil. The oil running a little bit warmer is not a big deal, but... I just don't think it was properly done when I was watching the guy do it back then it didn't seem like he really was doing really a good job at what he was doing and here we are now I'm under a load and I'm gonna be really pressed for time to make it for my delivery and depending on how that plays out I may or may not have to um, start canceling loads following that but Nonetheless, I'm in good spirits, man. I'm, you know, this this stuff happens. It is what it is. It don't feel good when it's a constant happening, but you know, what I've learned is you got to own the equipment and don't let the equipment own you, you know. Stuff's old, you know, and you're going to have problems with it. And when you have those problems, is either you're going to sit there and be, "Oh my god," and just you know start cursing up a storm and losing your cool or you just going to take care of it and do what you got to do you know and keep it moving and that's what i'm choosing to do i'm i'm not concerned about canceling loads or whatever loads will be there um the main thing is communication i already let my broker know what was going on and you know i could have tried to play roll the dice and take it but um, on a safety standpoint, it was not cool. And it was so much oil and grease up under there on them shoes and them drum that it was seriously a safety hazard. And I know if I was a DOT officer and I looked up under there, I would have put me out of service. So I wasn't willing to roll the dice. So I made the call to go ahead and shut it down and, and try and get it done. So I'm at a place now, uh, this is the second place I went to. The first place I went to, the guys act like they they really couldn't do it. I really think they didn't want to do it. Um, so they referred me to this place. And this place that I'm at, they have pretty, really good reviews. And um hopeful that they will be able to get me taken care of and get me back on the road here shortly. But um, nonetheless, like I said, y'all, I'm in good spirits, man. I'm, I've, I've been off for about a week week and a half or so uh, about a week yeah a good week a few days and um as always i got a lot done while i was home enjoyed my home time as i always do and um i, I was ready to get back on the road so um i'm gonna go ahead and include some pictures up here so you guys can see what this wheel seal look like man and and um yeah 
so i'm a little bummed about my brakes because again i just just had them brakes done man it's like ah uh, just had them done so i did tell the guy moving forward that i wanted them to repack it with grease and do away with that oil that the guy did when he did the first seal um I, I know that the oil is a lot cleaner for maintenance and it's easier for on a technician standpoint for them to do but it, it's a, a problem when it becomes a problem and that's what I don't like about the oil hubs um, I, I just like the grease you know it's always worked and I, I like the stuff that's simple that works so I'm going back with hub uh, regular grease like I said, none of my other wheels I have zero problems with. They all run in grease, all are packed. And I'm going to go that route with these. So, with that being said, moving right along, um, I'll keep you guys updated. Peace out.